Hello! It's Feel Good Friday! Whoopee! Lily, it's Feel Good Friday! Hi, I'm Margo Gunther and it's Friday. This is the 150th version of Feel Good Friday that I've done. I'm pretty impressed with myself, if I may say so myself. So let's start with an Evo size. And that's, I really want to talk a little bit about the basics of why I started these, right? But let's start with this. So we're just going to put our fingers on our temples, prop up your phone, get your hands free. Put your fingers on your temples, press deeply, make circles there, and then move those circles back towards your ears and then up over the back of your ears so you're rubbing where your ears and your head hook together and then when you get to the bottom drag that down your throat past your collarbone wow <laughs> i needed that i gotta say um wow lots going on in my life first of all what do you think does my house look a little different look at those floors my sister suggested that i pick up the rug and the coffee table to show off these floors because my house is trying to be sold anyway i'll talk about well anyway i've made this big announcement last week that i'm in love with another house and trying to buy it but of course first uh step is selling my house and anybody who's ever been in this position, oh my gosh, it is like one minute I'm going to pull the plug, the next minute I'm so in love with the house I can't stand it, the next minute I'm so in love with this house I don't want to part with it. I mean, it is really one of those kind of situations and, and I still have a little leeway. Um, so I'll be as surprised to find out what happens as anybody else. Um, so, wow! <laughs> my life is not simple my life is not easy but I have these amazing tools that help me through it so let's go back to March of 2020 it was uh, my mom's birthday which I knew it was her birthday but I didn't know that it was going to be such a significant date in feel-good history and um, if you remember where we were at in March of 2020, we were just um, hearing words like shelter in place and, you know, uh, wearing masks was a brand new thing. Don't go to medical facilities unless you're dying, you know, stay home, shelter in place. And there's this deadly virus that is out to get us if you don't act right right and a lot of people instantly lost their jobs you know it was it was a really 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 difficult time for our culture and and we have been profoundly changed by the events of March of 22 2020 and um, but I want you to just for a moment transport yourself back to that moment and uh, I was still in Mexico. I'd just gone and see Fish and Dead and & Company. And then right after Fish is when everything uh, got closed down. And uh, I remember riding my bicycle down to the beach to make this video. And literally every single business, banks, restaurants, stores, every single building on Main Street of Tulum was boarded up not just closed but boarded up and it was a it was a wild wild ride down there and i get to the beach and my main purpose for making that first video is that everywhere i looked on social media and in my real life people were freaking out and everybody's stress level was higher than normal which was already higher than it should be and you know we were in mortal danger and um and 
our evolutionary instincts when you're in mortal danger is to run really fast or fight really hard. And so that is the chemistry that was in our bloodstreams. And everybody was tensed up and freaking out. And when you're in that nervous system of fight or flight, your blood system is at the back of your brain, which is looking for worst case scenario in the past and in the future, and really no present time awareness is happening at all. It's all about, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, which is physical and emotional and mental. It was affecting everybody. And I was just like, I have to help somehow give people tools to, um, to change that, right? And so, uh, I did a lot of Evo sizing and I rode my little bicycle down to the beach and I made this video. It's pretty silly. If I'm going to post it. Um, it's on my YouTube channel so you can see it. And, uh, you know, I was sincerely trying to plead with people to understand that the only way to fight a virus is with a high immune system and stress lowers your immune system. So I wanted to give people tools that they could use to try to get their nervous system uh, to calm down so that their immune system would be higher, right? This was, and this is still a thing, right? So anyway, then I made this video, I put it up, it got quite a few views. And then the next week I made another one and another one and 150 weeks later, here we are. And I went through so much, five canceled plane tickets because remember the airlines went crazy. Um, dealing with my mom and her, her illness and then passing and then finding myself with a whole new life here in the States, buying this house fixing it up. You know, I mean, my life has had a lot of the same challenges you do. I lost my job that day too. And that's when I started doing online coaching. And that's one of the things that I'm super grateful to that whole pandemic mentality um, that we went through because it brought us Zoom. And Zoom brought me into people's homes where I could help them with serious issues that they were dealing with. And over the last, um, you know, three years since that all started, almost three years since that all started, um, I have worked with about a hundred people on Zoom all over the world and really, really helped them with their bigger issues, you know, pain, stress, um, autoimmune disorders, I even helped this girl with this weird neurological disorder. Um, wh what I have found by working with so many people, uh, migraines. Wow, I've had three different people with severe migraines that have been able to get them under control uh, by using the things that I teach. So on Feel Good Friday, um, I just basically do really simple stuff like the Evo sizes and showing you how to do self massage and stretching and stuff like that. But the full My Feel Good Way program is something I developed 20 years ago and have helped hundreds and hundreds of people end chronic pain. And in the, in the midst of that, um, they were able to really lower their stress because stress is the cause of most of our pain. And so my program takes you through kind of a, um, physical therapy kind of stuff. I help you change the way you walk, the way you stand, the way you sit, the way you sleep, because those are the things that you're doing that contribute to your pain, whether you know it or not. Our posture is the real problem, the forward head. Um, and so anyway, but then also knowing that if we can, that a, another big cause of our pain is the, is the clenching of our bodies. Check yourself right now. I bet your butt cheeks are clenched. I bet your shoulders are clenched. I bet your jaw and your face are not relaxed. Your body is not relaxed. And that constant tension, according to science, 
From the time we wake up till we go to bed, the human brain, even at rest, is slightly anxious. So that's my passion, is to really, really, really help people. And then in the meantime, I, I've been able to, you know, help all these people through private coaching. You're welcome to uh, contact me if you're, you've been thinking about that. Now's the time. And uh, also, I've been able to start doing retreats. I did two last year. I'm going to do two this year. Uh, the first one is May 9th through 13th. So all the information for that is on my uh, website, myfeelgoodway.com. So anyway, wow, what a journey. And what I really wanted to say uh, in today's video is thank you. Thank every one of you who watch these videos, who share these videos, who have coached with me, who have been to my retreats. Thank you for mirroring back to me that this program that I created just out of nothing has value and um, that, it, that it really does help people. I know it helps people because it helps me. Um, for example, you know, I had this surgery on my chest and I had to be in bad posture for several weeks because uh, I couldn't open my chest like I normally do. Thank God that's over. And in the process, I got some low back pain. But guess what? I did the things that I do and I don't have it anymore. So, you know, it really does work. I've known it. I, I, I have never doubted the value of my feel good way. I never have. I know that this is really an important thing that really helps people, right? All right, I'm going to shut up. Let's dance. And um, I heard my speakers. Uh, okay, so you know the drill. Get up off your butts and... Um, uh, I want you to get your hands free and I'm going to coach us through a very short, um, uh, half a body massage like I do every week. And this week we got some Jerry Garcia and John Kahn from 1986. I think I was there. I, and no, I know I was there. So. Just do what I do. Two hands whenever possible. I do like 10 to 20 head massages a day. Just say. fascia on the chest. I have to avoid certain areas so that YouTube doesn't get mad. <laughs> yeah! So, um, I've had a very stressful morning. I have a lot going on, uh, but I'm really Happy to be here with you. Draw all that towards your heart. And then just notice the difference between the side you just did and the side you didn't do. And if you didn't get up and dance with me, I want you to rewind this video and do it. Because it really does help. And you really can tell the difference. So, um, I love you. Thanks for your support over the last... 150 weeks without missing a week. Wow. I love you. Mwah.